Junior Day in Brevard County, consider this a spontaneous act of kindness. A city leader steps in to get results for a woman after thieves stole her only means of transportation. News 6's James Barbero has the story in West Melbourne. When a homeless woman's bicycle is stolen outside of this Publix, one city leader doesn't think twice about offering to help, giving the woman his own bike. You don't have to think about it. You just got to do the right thing. West Melbourne City Councilman and former Deputy Mayor John Tice recalling the moment around 9 Sunday night when he thought to check out some police activity happening at Publix. There's a lady there crying because somebody stole her bike. Officers say she was likely homeless and unfortunately the theft happened outside the view of the store's surveillance cameras, leaving police with little to go on and leaving the woman without her only way of getting around town. And so I asked the officer, I said, listen, if you can't find her bike, let me know and I'll give her mine. That's when she just busted out in tears. She was trying to say thanks in between the tears. After his generosity moved the woman emotionally, Tice says two hours later, officers came to his door and the councilman came through on his word. And I aired up the tires and <laughs> and off they went. How long did you have to think before you thought, this is what I'm gonna do to make this right? Spontaneous, it wasn't even a thought. Why was that? I think that's what everybody should do. I don't think it's anything out of the ordinary. Getting results in West Melbourne, James Sparvero, News 6. Isn't that what everyone should do? Mm -hmm. Police are still looking to find the woman's bike. It's a black and gray seven speed mountain bike. If you have any information and would like to help, we're sharing the right number to call on our website. That's clickorlando.com powered by News 6.